Try to be kind, but you are a freak and a liar and wasting everybody's time. The organs below the belt are for reproduction and removing of bodily waste. There's no reason that when I go to buy a soda or a transmission, I need to be distracted by your privates dangling about. Now, when I go to the store to buy an air conditioning filter, I'd rather not have to look at your moneymaker, amigo. I'm glad you are proud of it. But when people of Vice City are in a quickie mart, they should be able to have a simple financial transaction without seeing your firehose. Are you with me? Sorry, Maurice. That's okay. Just try to behave. I think the sun must have got to you or something. Yes, maybe that's it. But uh, Maurice, if I may, you have a fine show here, and, and I'm glad to be on it. But everyone within the sound of my voice and smell will die in the fires of doom. It is written, TV is trash, radio is trash, our newspapers are run by Canadians with an agenda. Our very way of life is threatened. We formed this great state to play golf, and I'll be damned if any weirdo hippies are going to tell us we can't fill in wetlands and make a home for ourselves, complete with 18-hole championship standard courses and selective admission. Heathens will ruin the land, acid will rain from the skies, we'll never hear my voice again, it will be anarchy. TV teaches immorality. Refugees, glue, the price of tea in China. How can we raise children in this environment? My little boy asked me the other day, Mommy, are unicorns real? What am I supposed to say to that? Do I lie and make myself as bad as the boy's father? Or do I break the little boy's heart and ruin his life so that he ends up a nudist or a freak or something? It's a difficult question, Jack. Very difficult question. Is it right to lie? Close or a lie, Maurice? No, Barry. Close or a way of keeping warm and not getting arrested. No policeman has ever hit me with his trunch. I'd like to hit you back to hell, you sicko. You're filth. Human, 